Praised be Jesus and Mary. In 1595, when uh, St. Joseph was a boy, the, uh, the Orthodox Bishop of uh, Brest Litovsk in uh, Belarus and five other bishops uh, representing millions of Ruthenians uh, sought reunion with Rome. And uh, Josephat, who was uh, known as uh, John Kusevich at that time, uh, was to dedicate his life and to suffer his death in the same cause. Um, born in what was uh, then Poland, he went to, to work in Vilno and was uh, influenced by the clergy adhering to the Union of Brest. Uh, he became a Basilian monk, then a, a priest, and was uh, soon well known as a, a preacher and an ascetic. He became uh, Bishop of Vitebsk at a, a relatively young age and, and faced a difficult situation. Uh, most monks um, fearing interference with the liturgy and customs didn't want uh, union with Rome. But uh, by synods and a catechetical instruction, a reform of the clergy and personal example, he was successful in winning the, the greater part of the Orthodox in that area to the Union. Uh, unfortunately, the following year, a, a dissident hierarchy was set up and his opponents spread the accusation that uh, Josephat had gone Latin and that uh, all his people would have to do the same. And despite warnings, um, he went back uh, to Vitebsk, which was uh, still a hotbed of trouble. <clears throat> Attempts were made to stir up uh, trouble and drive him from the diocese. A uh, priest was sent to shout insults at him from his own courtyard. And when the bishop had him removed and shut up in his house, the uh, opposition rang the uh, town hall bell and a mob assembled. Uh, the priest was released, but uh, members of the mob broke into the bishop's home. Um, he was struck with a halberd and then shot, and his body was uh, thrown into the river. His body was recovered five days later and exposed for nine days, constantly uh, emitting a, a fragrance of roses and lilies. Uh, the, a counselor of uh, Politus, where the, uh, the body was returned, abandoned the schism uh, merely at the sight of the archbishop's uh, beautiful countenance. Many of the guilty uh, struck their breast and did likewise. The, uh, the archbishop had gone gladly to his death, offering his life that the schism might end. Um, he had said as much beforehand, uh, four years after his death, the, the false archbishop uh, consecrated his life to penance, a prayer, and the defense of the Union. Uh, such changes of heart, you know, are the, the greatest miracles uh, won by the sanctity of the, the true servants of God. Um, about uh, five years after St. Josephat's martyrdom, uh, his body was found intact though the clothing had rotted away. And again, in uh, 1637, it was still white and supple, and a beautiful silver reliquary 
was made for it with a, a life-size uh, image of the, the saint upon it, uh, lying in state. Um, the, the body was again exposed, intact, in 1767. It was eventually uh, taken to the Basilica of St. Peter in Rome. Uh, Pope Leo XIII canonized St. Josephat in uh, 1867. Uh, he was the first saint of the Eastern Church to be canonized by Rome. So today we pray to St. Josephat that our Lord's Prayer may be realized, that, uh, that we all be one. Thank you.